just a couple of days away from the westbound lanes of 465 closing on the south side. Yeah, the eastbound closures seem to go pretty smoothly, right, with Indot crews wrapping up ahead of schedule. Well, Friday night, it is time now for the westbound lanes. Carlos Diaz is live this morning with the detours you'll need to start preparing for to take next week. Good morning. Good morning, Julia. Ben, don't jinx us because it was smooth sailing last week. And this week, coming up on Friday, it's basically just what happened last week in reverse. Instead of the eastbound lanes, you're talking about the westbound lanes. Let's bring in Scott Manning from NDOT. And it really is, as we see a map of what we're talking about, what we're going to be experiencing starting at, at 9 p.m. on Friday, it really is just a reverse of what happened last week. Absolutely. Just a mirror image. So we're working in the same area of town, the southwest side of Indy, between I-70 and I-65. Just this time around, the westbound lanes will be closed. Eastbound lanes will be open. Okay. So one of the big concerns is the detail tour that you guys had for last week when you had the eastbound lanes. Now the detour that you're suggesting for this time is I-65 northbound to I-70 westbound. A lot of people complained last week because there was some bottlenecking going on downtown, some extra congestion. How are you going to solve that problem or help that problem this time around? Well, this time around, we do have some extra signage up on I-65 and I-70 um, to alert folks that use those routes every day as their mm -hmm. primary route. Know that there'll be some extra traffic there. Plan ahead. Allow for some extra time. And we also know that in addition to the official detour route, there are some other options with local streets, you know, East Street, Harding, Kentucky Avenue. Those are good options to get from the south side into and out of downtown. So we really encourage folks to plan ahead, check the maps, find the route that works best for them. All right. Well, coming up, guys, in the next half hour, we're going to be talking about weather and how the weather next week is going to be affecting how this construction will be going. Ben, Julia? All right, sounds good, Carlos. Thank you guys very much. And by the way, if you'd like to look at the detour routes and the closure details, just go to WTHR.com slash Survive 465. All the information is collected right there for you. Well, today, 